Welcome back to another flipped classroom tutorial. Today we're going to look at two essential features of Gmail. These are probably the two most used features in my inbox and they are labels and filters. Now labels and filters will make the job of managing your inbox much much easier. So first of all let me show you where you can find labels and filters simply click on the little cogwheel go to settings now under settings you will see labels over here and filters so let's start off by looking at labels what are labels labels will highlight or label your emails now we have a whole bunch of system labels now what we want to do is we want to create our own labels so scroll all the way down and click on create a new label. Now this label will be flipped classroom tutorials. Now I am not going to nest this label under a different label, but if you would like to do that, you can create an entire organizational structure for your labels. So let's create that label now. And what you will see is that now that label is available on the left hand side the reason for this is so I can easily click on the little arrow and give it a label color this is great if you are a visual learner and again your inbox will have lots of different colors and that will make it much easier for you to find the correct emails so in this case I will select green so I now have a green flipped classroom tutorial label. So let's go and have a look at my inbox. I can now, as you can see, I've sent myself an email called label me please. I can select this email and on the top I have a, an option and I can label this. So I tick the wanted label and click apply. Now you see this is much easier to find. You can see, instantly see that all the green ones will be flipped classroom tutorials and it will save you a lot of time. Now I don't want to do this manually and that is where we have our filters. Our filters will come in so I'm just going to undo this label now to show you how filters work. And I want this automatically labeled. So let's go to settings instead of going to labels this time we go to filters and I'm going to add a filter so click on create a new filter you can have a from email address for instance your boss's email address and whenever your boss sends you an email it automatically labels it as important you can have a subject or you can use has the words now that's what I'm going to use and what I want to use is whenever I get an email and it has the words flipped classroom I want it to automatically label it so we go all the way down click on create filter and now it asks me what do you want this filter to do I can choose do I want it to skip the inbox I don't want to do that do I want to mark it as red no not at all I want to apply a label so I'm going to choose the label flipped classroom tutorials I create that filter and I can also apply that to all my previous conversations and emails so tick that box click on create filter and now when I am in my inbox all my previous flipped classroom emails have automatically been labeled I'm going to show you how this works. I'm going to send another email to myself. The subject will be flipped classroom testing. I'm going to put some random letters there and I send this. Now you will see as this email enters my inbox, it automatically gets assigned to the correct label. So let's refresh my inbox here we are automatically assigned a new label color coded and very easy to find I hope this tutorial was useful do let me know what you would like to see next 
and if you found this useful in the comments below.